Welcome back to Blackacre Ranch, everybody. Look who I've got. My name's Jeff, and this is, well, 139. Um, Paul, you know who you are. You mentioned buffalo and their names, and uh, he suggested I name number 149. And uh, he suggested the name of Kisses, since she's the one that seems to lick the gate, lick the truck, whatever else. So. 139 will be kiss 149 will be kisses 139 they all have names yes but i haven't published them but i like kisses we'll go with that anyway welcome back it's good to have you let me get you up here hey what do you know what do you know look who showed up it's kisses there she is let's see if we can get a better look all right so yep there paul there you have it it's little kisses. So anyway, that's the beauty of it. Good old kisses. Um, naturally, she wants some cubes, but I just gave them all cubes. I put them in three different spots to spread them around a little bit. We don't have any new babies this week. Right, kisses? Isn't that right? Number one is super swollen and close, man. Super close. You can even see that number 139 is close. Okay, so I know people have done like, how do you know if a buffalo is gonna have a baby soon, right? There's really, it's hard to tell. There's no like huge indicator like, oh, my water broke. You know, those kinds of things. It's not like super simple. Little test. They look a little swollen in the tummy, but that's no like key super indicator here. Um, but if, the, if they are pregnant, you'll find that they'll start to drop. Um, so when they start having the baby really low, hmm, sound familiar? Um, can you tell if it's really low versus not? You know, 93 that one time, she looked low. So you knew it was coming quicker. 139, not so much yet. Looks like we got some ruckusing going on. As you can see, Bartok doesn't really care. Anyway, what I was saying, or trying to get to, is if you look at the back end of 139 below the tail, you'll see some vaginal swelling. Um, you can see discharge. That's when they're getting imminently close. Um, she doesn't have any of that yet. She's a little swollen, but nothing like crazy. Um, is she dropped? Eh, I don't know. So those are some things you might look for to see if a, a female is about to have birth, but it's not for certain. The lost baby. <laughs> it's really hard to predict pregnancy when they're going to birth. You know, we can't even get vets to tell us accurately whether or not it's actually pregnant or not. So. Anyway, those are just some indicators, whatever. So number one is super swollen. She is way swollen and she has some discharge and she's been like that for like, gosh, two, three weeks. So she's gotta be close. She's gotta be going. Um, number 18 and number 14 have not. They've kind of settled down in their indications. So they don't seem to be as far along as I would have thought. Let's check out this herd, man. Look what's going on. In case you're wondering, yes, there is a hierarchy in Buffalo, even for the females, right? The dudes, they pretty much know where it's at. I think, again, Bartok's dominant. I think Ahmed isn't, um, but we're coming up on the season, right? July into August, you start getting that rut going on and everybody starts getting horny. Everybody starts getting to do some stuff. I don't know if Bartok and Ahmed are gonna necessarily fight it out, but the females are obviously showing the most sign of fighting it out. So in the next coming weeks, we'll start seeing more of that rut hopefully going on. Honestly, I think I've heard that they usually don't do it all during the day. Um, so it's more like an evening thing, but we may not even get any film of it. But anyway, the rut, they're gonna start getting pregnant again, hopefully soon. Here we have our newest baby, number 14, did have her baby. 
Um, and it's just a little one. Just a little one. Isn't it cute? All right, let's go find number one and check on her. Here's number one. Look what she's got. So two new babies. Hey, it's been a great week, guys. Hey, I hope you enjoy the video. It's just a little snippet. Uh, we do officially have only two now left to have babies, number 139 and number 18. So we will keep you posted. Hey, thanks for joining us today, everybody. Uh, thought I'd give you a little snippet. I know it's not a super long video, but I wanted to give you a little snippet about pregnancies, uh, signs, and to let you know we have kisses, number 149. So hope you enjoyed it. This, of course, is Ahmed. Can't say goodbye without seeing Ahmed. And um, anyway, we'll catch you next week. Bye.